Via Metropolitan Transit poised to put a new type of transportation on San Antonio streets. The Biden administration announced last week it was recommending federal funding for a north south corridor for advanced rapid transit or ART here in the Alamo City. Now VIA presented its plans to the city council today, saying that passengers could hop on this new line as soon as 2027. Our Garrett Berger joins us now. So Garrett, first of all, what is this new plan all about? Well, ART is essentially a larger bus running typically in a dedicated lane on the roads, arriving every 10 to 15 minutes. Now, VIA officials say this provides the benefits of a rail line without the cost. Now, in all, the planned 12 mile route from the airport through downtown to the Mission Concepcion area would still cost quite a bit, about $320 million to set up. The recommended federal grant funding would cover close to half of that cost. The redirected sales tax voters approved back in November 2020 would both help secure a loan for another big chunk of funding the project and help keep the corridor running once it's operational. Now, VIA's president and CEO said they'd like to start on a second east to west ART corridor as well, but they first have to find local funding so they can get the federal dollars. I think it's going to be a kind of project that's going to rank very high, medium high at least. So I, I'm not concerned about that. Uh, but we still have to have the funding because federal government won't give you their part if you don't have your part. However, he said VIA would just need a one-time source of funds to set up the second quarter. They would not need the funding to continue to operate it. Now, without with the ART using a dedicated lane on a majority of the route, VIA's CEO did say that they will likely have to take away some lanes and traffic, lanes of traffic in part of the route in order to make this work. Live at City Hall, I'm Garrett Berger, KSAT 12 News.